Good morning, Lighthouse. It's day nine. I've got a devotion I want to bring to you that really kind of hit home with me when I read this passage of Scripture. In Matthew chapter 17, verses 14 through 16, the Scriptures read this, And when they had come to the multitude, a man came to him, came to Jesus, kneeling down to him and saying, Lord, have mercy on my son, for he is an epileptic and suffers severely. He often falls into the fire and often into the water. So I brought him to your disciples, but they could not cure him. This speaks to a time in this man's life, his father's life, that where he had to humble himself, and he had tried other options. He had asked other people to pray, and he had tried other uh, doctors and different things, but his son was in need and needed relief from his physical condition. Not only his son needed relief, but this father and probably these, these parents needed relief as well. And it's a perfect example of how Many of us get to a point in our life where we finally humble ourselves and we finally bring our need to Jesus. And so many times in my life I can look back where I, I lost my way and I maybe struggled longer than maybe I should have because I was trying to do it on my own or I was trying to pray my way through it or trying to uh, discipline my way through it. And you, you know right now through fasting, Fasting is a tough thing. Fasting is a discipline that you have to really practice in your life. And it's, it's day nine and we're, we're trying to fight through some things and you're starting to, re, starting to remember why you're fasting. And, and it's, for me, it's not becoming, it's becoming more about what God wants to do in my life and less about what I need to eat today. And more importantly, when you humble yourself, humility always brings us into a place where God can, can really use us and more importantly where God can really perform a miracle in our life. My, my encouragement to you today is this, through this time of fasting, whatever it is you've been struggling with, it may be an addiction, it may be a habit in your life, if you will humble yourself and begin to pray and you will actually do like this man did and said, you know what Lord, I brought this to your disciples, they couldn't help me, Lord I'm bringing it to you, I need relief. And through prayer, when you humble yourself and say, Lord, I'm bringing it to you. I'm laying it at your feet. It's in those moments of humility that God's able to perform a miracle in our life. My encouragement to you today is this. Bring it to Jesus. During this time of fasting, stop trying to do it on your own. Humble yourself today and bring it to the Lord and let Him provide a way where there seems to be no way. God bless you and I'll see you tomorrow.